Hello, this is Massimo and in this video I'm going to talk about a common graphics issue that might happen with QSC Plus version 5 on Windows. So I've just installed uh, version 5 in this folder and if I launch it for the first time it will ask to uh, have permission to access uh, the private network. So you need to hit allow here to grant permissions. So what happens is that if I add some, uh, for example, generic RGB fixtures and then I go to the 3D view, the view is completely black. If I select everything with Ctrl A, as you can see, the fixtures are actually there. So the, the environment is there, but it's not rendered properly. This is because I am on a laptop with two graphics card where uh, the Intel card is the default one that Windows uses uh, and it's the one embedded in the processor and the uh, other card is an Nvidia card uh, which Windows consider as a high performance card so let's see how to resolve this issue so I'm gonna close QSC um, I'm gonna open the settings panel then go to system display and then go to graphics and here you have a list of the uh, applications that you have special um, permissions over graphics uh, for Windows so if you add a desktop application and you go to the QSC plus 5 installation and you select the uh, executable you hit OK and then here you have the preference for the GPU to use when rendering the application. If you let Windows decide, uh, Windows will use the Intel card. So if you select the high performance card, in this case I have this NVIDIA card here, and then uh, it, it's it, and then you go to um, again, QSC Plus again. So let's do the same thing I did before so let's add some generic fixtures you go to the 3d view and now you have your 3d view if I select everything I can move them around and basically this is it the issue is resolved by selecting the proper graphics card used by Windows thanks for watching and ciao